And hey there, it's me Mudlink and welcome back to some more Andran Saga. Last time, finished off the rest of the Gaiden chapter. Got to learn a bit more about some other history stuff with uh, our Eunice as well as, you know, trying to figure out if we should trust Darius. Either way, we decided, you know, let's do this mission. Rescue the slavers that we, that we can. We also gotta keep these dancers alive as much as possible. And destroy the camps. I mean, it's easy enough for the... Oh, they have a wary fighter. And they can't be crit- wow, that's annoying. At least they have no res, so it's perfect. That's gonna take a while to kill them, though. Uh, like, who can anyone here even do 60 damage flat out? Closest is like you with a battle axe, yeah. I mean, brave axe actually can help. Probably get close to one rounding, but since they have actually defense that. Well, anyway, let's just do this. Should probably. I mean, I have Gale Force right now, it's fine. I can just. Ah, oh, you don't have a great, a great. You don't have a bow, so fuck you. Perfect, now I can bring Isabel here. And axe visit. We've watched several slave caravans pass our village these past few months. The law prevents the raising of unwilling Stixians, but foreigners are not citizens. Those poor souls are going to be turned into undead slaves against their will. Find this nice sword in the sand early. You can have it if you if you help those souls. I'm sure there are lots of other items buried in the sand too if you know where to look. If you're keen-eyed thieves are on the lookout for treasures lost beneath the dunes. Ooh, base champ shear, nice. Okay, nothing there right now, and then... Yeah, you have good, decent res- like, I say decent res, but you like, no res at, all, res at all, so... No res and no res. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Fucking Angelus has intense amounts of res. Oh, got a silver blade! Hell yeah, so... Look where the bones are. That's the easiest thing to think of. But it's already there. Nice based. Glaciers. Fuck your wing clipper. I wish they would have dropped it wing clipper, but. Okay, you guys go down here. Go ahead, crit me. It's gonna not do much to me. Even if you double crit me, I'm fine. And I miss. That's all good. That gave me like no experience. Ah, oh, fucking Bardich does so much goddamn damage. Oh, I love you, man. Fuck you, you're dead. Yeah, and you guys are gonna do nothing, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Hang on. Oh, that was a bad time for me to pause. And also, well, I gotta restart anyway, so hang on. Also, that was a fucking spam call. Okay, so a better thing now. Uh, <laughs> there we go, now I'm out of range. I was just barely in fucking range. Okay, bring you down there. I'll actually bring you here. There we 
bring Isabel there, and then Barrett up here, you up here. Dawn up there, Runa down here, Buggy here. Let's see, that's a civil blade. The civil blade is pretty damn good, so I gotta get that. I'm gonna bet there's a boot somewhere. You get like no experience from these guys. HP, one strength, skip magic, skill, speed, luck, defense, and two res. Nice. These guys are just gonna get fucked by you, yeah. Did you hit, whatever. Yeah, dance the fucking monkey. Okay, I'm stuck on guard, dude. I guess I gotta stand here all day. Twiddle my thumbs, picking my nose. I go crazy in this heat. Sheesh. Fourth undead reinforcements to protect those prison camps. Oh, fuck. Yeah, so skeleton cohort. Okay, so now he's different stats here. I'm very confused. These fucking whites, they're gonna. You have a dragon axe? Oh, you have a fucking dragon axe. Dickhead! Thirty-one, forty-two. Yeah, that's good damage there. Got one campsite done. Brought down the prison camp. Protect those civilians. I just realized I'm stupid. I'm just gonna get fucking hit, god damn it. I'm fucked now. Already. Fucking Christ. Oh, then all my troopers there, okay. You get out of there. Okay, shining bow, bump. Oh shit. Well, I just realized I keep on fucking up. Hang on. You got the silver blade again. Time I just gotta not be dumb and just wait for those enemies, uh, wait for the summoner and the rest of those terrorists to die first before destroying the fucking campsite. Ow. Fucked again, guys. Could have got the silver blade again. Yeah, you get the fuck out. Buggy. Sadly, no chances to really buggy blast here, but eh. Get out of your skill speed, luck defense. Cap speed, there we go.
Just gotta be careful, gotta be careful. You don't have any... Yeah, you have Dragon Axe, so it's fine. Fuck, I didn't kill... Asshole. Thing now is I should no no. Oh, I know the perfect thing to do. Eat that boss there. If I can. No, I can't. Fucking, I can't kill anything else. Except for a dancer, but I can't kill those fucking guy, that guys. Okay, no one can reach, that's good. Good, good, good. Oh! Bro, you see that? Yeah, bro, looks like a battle's breaking up. You can take advantage of the chaos and plunder the village, bro. Great idea, bro. That looks... Oh, that seems to be Varg. And oh yeah, he's definitely related to Runa. That's definitely Runa's father. Uh, hello to you, gentlemen. Such a lovely day outside. What do you want, bro? I was wondering if you two could tell me how to reach the Tomb of Horrors. I'm afraid I've gotten lost in this desert. It was a lot bigger than I thought. Bro, are you for real? The to Tomb of Horrors? Nobody goes to the Tomb of Horrors, bro. I mean, just listen, freaking listen to the name. Tomb of freaking Horrors, bro. You don't want to go there. It's a actually, I do. My family lost a very valuable tome in that place, and I intend to find it. Going to the Tomb of Horrors for some book? You're crazy or something. So quite sane, as at least as far as I know. Many from my house are not quite so lucky. Anyway, I must leave. Enjoy your plundering. Wait a minute, you know about our business, bro? Of course, you are just as brigands, and you are headed towards that village. Only a fool would be unable to detect your true intentions based on the evidence. Bro, he's gonna tell Sethos. Yeah, bro, can we can't let you leave. Your course of action is ill-advised. Your chances of success are slim. Even if you two team up against me, you'll both be utterly annihilated. Bro, our entire gang is on the way. You don't stand a chance, bro. How many members do your, does your gang have? 10? 20? I give you a 7% chance of success at, success at best. Bro, this guy's arrogant. Let's teach him a lesson. Yeah, bro, let's smash his skull and never ceases to amaze me how easily you brigands throw away your own lives. It's almost as if you exist solely to be slaughtered for entertainment. Well, huh? <laughs> yeah, you're getting fucked. Uh, okay, well, at least I don't die here. It also looks like it's gonna stone me, but it doesn't. Boom! That's my girl. Strength speed. It's an exorcism tome right there. Maybe three damage, yeah, you're fucked. Yeah, adept, nice. No crits at all, but eh, adept still. I mean, Varg's still getting hit, but I mean, he's not doing any damage at all. <sighs> oh shit. That was actually smart of the AI. God damn. Night Tide, that's so cool. They hit Fire Fenrir, Nosferatu, to illuminate. Yeah. Oh, okay, you're you're kind of cool. Yeah, I know it. Okay, sorry about that. Anyway, so we gotta get Amelia towards him, which uh, shouldn't be too bad. Stone there, 3 HP, magic skill speed, luck, pants, and rest. I love your fucking levels, man. But then a prison camp, there goes the civilians there. Gotta beat you there. We have to beat you though, which is easy enough.
Oh, Helga completely destroys those fucking enemy camps. God damn! So, yeah, one dancer here. One dancer in every little corner here. One, two. It's only four dancers, which is fine. That was a longbow. Longbow is gonna do fuck all to me. I feel like one day I'm just gonna fucking accidentally attack. Okay, protect the civilians and then. Uh... Really hope there's no fucking enemy reinforcements in the back line. Hopefully they just show up in here. So I forgot what stat it needs you need I forgot what stat you need for the finding treasure. I think it's luck? No, it's skill. I always forget. I mean, you're dead. Strength, defense, and res. Oh, Ragnarok is so fucking stupid. You see, he did so little damage to Jahari, he attacked fucking Jaka. Oh, okay, good. Thank God it's a longbow. Watch out, nomads are circling in our camp from the east. Are you filming here to deal with all of them? That's too much work. Oh, fuck off. He sends his reinforcements instead. Hey, hey, watch out, you idiots. Nomads are approaching. Don't let them ruin my tent. I really like this tent. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, so, um... Well, if it's nomads, I can't fucking bring you. Even though you have a fucking Pyrian shield. Oh god, uh... Okay, let's get careful right now. Careful, careful, careful. Nope, nothing there. Okay, bring you here now. Easy enough. Bring Runa there and then Amelia's gonna go towards Varg. Barrett's gonna go there too. Ilanda's gonna keep on going forward though. Fuck. Okay, still nothing there. Protect the civilians, protect the civilians. No one can reach, no one can reach. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Ooh, nice dodge. You need to dodge, but thank god you did. Yeah, 
Okay, three. Okay, it's three there. More nomads are on their way. Make sure you take care of them. Too late to do anything about it. It's from that side. Ugh, oh, fucking... Way too little hit. Fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Be very, very, very careful. Still nothing. I can't spend much time in, you know, fucking. Oh no, they're in the fucking way. Great. Oh, none of them can reach those kids, but they can reach that one. Uh... All of them can reach that one, so... Uh... Yeah, no matter what I do, I can Okay, so I uh, gotta... Rescue, then. Oh, oh no, but they're gonna just dance and fucking kill that one. Fuck. That's so annoying. That's really obnoxious right now. Okay, just figure it out, figure it out, figure it out, figure it out, figure it out. I'll spice. Be skill. That's, uh, that, that guy dropped the elixir, I'm pretty sure. So that's definitely not. That would be a shit reward for um, exploring around. Still nothing, still nothing, still nothing, nothing there, okay. Oh, nice, you don't even double. Okay, you can kill if you get lucky. Not like that, though. And... Okay. Slightly better now. I have people on this side, people on this side. Nice level. No, I can't do that. This side, I guess, goes toward Vard, Varg. Nothing there. Oh, what? This so guy's fucking one space up. This is a silver blade. I ah, fucking dickhead. Nice level. Yeah, 
can't do that. Yeah. Yeah, the only problem now is... Yeah... Gotta be careful, gotta be careful. Ah, oh, fuck, I could actually kill them that turn. Stop doing that, dick. Okay, more of these fucking guys. Okay, I gotta hurry up, and I'm, like, doing such a shit job at finding these goddamn... These guys have like no stats at all. These guys are not a thread, what the fuck? There you go, Tendaris getting some good fucking experience. Be sure to get guarantees, guarantee, guaranteed kills, guaranteed kills with Silver X. Yeah, pretty much guaranteed, there we go. Okay, now I got the fucking Silver Blade from here. Where's the other treasure? I got no fucking idea. I just completely annihilate every single guy here, and then ow. Thank god it's a dodge. Get out of here, luck. Fucking. Okay, got nice level. Okay, I just gotta focus, focus. More reinforcements done. Got it hidden in Nosferatu, based. Get more kids there. Yoo-hoo, I spy a familiar face. Hello, Brother Varg. Angelus, is that you? Indeed, it is I. What are you wearing? Do you like my traveling attire? It certainly is unique, you look like a bard. Have you taken up the arts of to mingle among commoners? <laughs> indeed, indeed. I see then, what are you doing in Styxia? Oh, we have a, co a common on a heroic mission to free the slave the free slaves. Oh, so you're fighting so you're with that group fighting the slavers. Correct, we're all heroes. You should join us, brother. Not until I've located the tomb of horrors. We're still searching for Nemesis Dark Dark Home. After all this time Nemesis Dark Home, what? 
My sources tell me that he yet that he yet possesses the Void Flare Tome. I was hoping to wrest it from his cold, undying clutches. See, then you should join my goodest friend, Jaka. I doubt you will be able to defeat Nemesis on your own. There's strength in numbers. Are you heading toward the Tomb of Horrors yourselves? Not at the moment. Do you have reason to believe that it's going to change soon? <laughs> this far, its lips must remain sealed. I see, so it's like that. So it's like that, I see. How is the seer, Angelus? I have no idea what you could be talking about. Hmm. And there you go. Now he's a part of our crew, and... Yeah, I mean, his growths are... Like, about alright, but I mean, he's got decent bases right now. No, no, turn on it. Animations... Hang on, let me check for Runa here. Runa, yep, I knew it. I knew it. I fucking knew it. And now you guys can join up with the rest of them. We talk to Varg too. Flashbacks are about to have company. No bads inbound. Okay, so it's three, four there. Okay. And one's there. Okay. Magic luck and defense. Res. Oh no, I can't kill, I can't beat that camp yet. Uh, keep you guys down here. No, nothing there. Bring you down, continue to bring you down so you can get that village. There's only those two villages? Yeah, it's only those two villages. Hmm. And but it's gonna go by this way. I get fucking no experience to dawn. That's fine, she's gonna level up soon anyway. Have you seen those women being forced to accompany Lord Sethos and his men? They are led by Zari, one of Styx's most famous performers, a real beauty she is. King Kangax sent Miss Zari and her dancers along with the slavers as entertainment, probably to keep them from ripping each other apart under the desert sun. I can only imagine the things they must put up with, surrounded by those brutes. If you haven't heard any of the dancers, they are innocent bystanders in all this. Take this, please. Just promise me that you won't lay a hand on those poor girls. And I won't. So I actually want to fucking... I don't know if, if uh, hopefully that recruit. Sorry, I'd love to have another dancer, but let's see. Also, damn man, you're really. Uh... Beat that last one there. 
And if you clear the clamps, you're no longer on the clock. The map one, once all slavers on the map have been dealt with, brigands and dancers don't count. So then protect as many civilians as you're able to. Now I have to route the slavers. Okay, so which ones are still around? There's none around. Set the weight. Be strength, magic, speed, luck, defense. Watch out, idiot. A large group of nomads are headed this way. You guys are probably screwed. So in the bottom right corner there. Well, that's fine. There we go. There was something there. Fuck. Holy sword. I mean, that's alright, I guess. Oh, you guys are still gonna get fucked by Don. Okay, let's see. Uh, nope, nothing there. Anything here? Nope. Trying to figure out what the fuck exactly is left here. Do oh, I could have talked to Bark with Jaka. Not like I think it matters much. We're trying to steal our slaves from ranks. We won't let them. Sothos so has finally showed up. That's good. It means he's not running back to daddy. Oh, what are you waiting for? Ice him. Damn right I will. Nice. Even got the crit that I kind of needed. Okay, he's got the brave weapons. And then... Bing, bada boom. Uh, let's see. How much damage you guys do? Oh, you do. That guy did a lot, but. I think it'll all be fine. Yeah, look at that fuck. In there. Oh, I went too far out. Fuck. You're brave. Oh no, you have the bow equipped though, so I can't really do much else. I mean, Tindaris can attack, at least, but you can't. You're just gonna get instantly fucked. Yep. Yeah. I mean, you actually won round, but I'm not risking that. I mean, have to though. I don't know who you are, but you're not taking. You're not taking our slaves. Oh, nice crit. <laughs> well, I couldn't really get all the hidden items. Let me actually look up to see which ones I missed. I missed like the better rewards. I missed the blue gem that was in the area with the arm. I missed the pet rock. I missed the hammer and I missed the light brand. Light brand would have been hard to get. M missing the pet rock kind of sucked for Thea. Same for the blue gem, just to get extra money. King Tongox, forgive me. Oh man, would have killed you anyway with Helga, but hey. The Doris level up. Yeah. For HP, baby. It's down to 69, but whatever. Oh no, uh, I'm still good. Still more reinforcements, I guess, so I have to wait until turn 13 anyway. Okay, light brand here, yep. Oh my god, I guess it's good I looked up the location of these things then.
Alright, we're done with the camp. Let's head back to camp. Fuck! Got, I got the light brand, I guess. It's fine. Are you alright? Thank you for saving all of us. You did a wonderful job. Yeah, you were all super brave. Thank you for being heroes. We were terrible rumors of what was going to happen. We were planning to turn us into walking corpses. None of that will happen now. You're safe with us. What was the reason you were captured by this caravan? All we did was protest King Mortimer for not helping us when we started. We didn't do anything wrong. We only voiced our discontent. I need to send us a throne into the dungeons without even a trial. Sometime later, that Stixie man set those arrived to the slavers. The dungeons clean. Not a soul remained behind. I cannot believe King Mortimer would commit such terrible acts. He rid himself of protesters by selling his prisoners. Even for Mortimer, that's... Where are, we, where are we to go now? I will assign some men to escort you. Hide near the Emperor Mountains. Silver Mist Village to the east should keep you far away from from prying eyes. How long should we hide till we deal with King Mortimer? Wait, I remember now. You're part of army. Saw you on the day Mouthrack burned. It came to our aid when no one else would. Yes, we tried to save the city, and in the end, it was a, it was a futile effort. Say no such thing. Mortimer may have driven you out, but we but we never forget forgot. We lost our heroes. If you had not shown up that day, we would be dead. We found useful items in the camp of the slavers, and we want you to have it. Thank you. Have a safe journey to Silver Mist. Your rewards for saving the slaves. Holy axe and based. White gem, thank you, so I don't miss out. I don't feel bad for missing out on the blue gem. Talisman. Not as good as a pet rock, but whatever. Learned. Oh, I learned leadership. Or. Hang on. It's like the. I I remember that I, remember, I recognize the skill icon because it's like the ace attorney it's like the ace attorney uh, point. Is it leadership? No, it's not leadership. It's inspiration. Yeah, inspiration. There you go. I was within two space to get plus two damage dealt and minus two damage received. So that's amazing for Jaka. These stick scenes are fierce. They've impressed me. I'm surprised now one tried to flee. They, they must really value their slaves. I imagine a painful death would await them had they tried to run away. Some of them suffered painful deaths anyway. Try not to sound too happy about it, Helga. It looks like a new friend is coming this way. Well fought, well fought, well fought, well fought. An impressive showing. I particularly enjoyed how those fools screamed. Nye, nye, nye. Seem a little too happy despite how those stick scenes were slaughtered. But they were you they were young people, yes. They were my father's they were my father's soldiers, and they were evil slavers. We shall not mourn them. You were true to your word, Darius. The slave did come from Onderon. Of course, you can trust me. A liege does not lie. My liege is more honest than you deserve. I think it's time for you to tell us the true goals. Why are you going up against your own father? I don't, I don't mind helping you in your ambitions, said Darius. I just wanted this to be a fair trade for our equal efforts. Very well. I suppose the con continent will learn the truth soon enough. You see, my father is no longer human. What? He's become a lich, an immortal king. He wishes to rule until the end of time. Did he learn nothing from the previous two kings who attempted to do the same? This is what caused the Lightbringers to declare war in 60 in the past. Yeah, too bad those Lightbringers aren't around to stop him, eh? They're too busy rotting in the soft and on soil to notice. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we literally have the first ever Light... Well, technically the first ever Lightbringer with us. So, uh, yeah. Well, you're not wrong. What do you mean? Dawn is... I guess technically... From what I ended up finding out, Dawn is a, is a character you can actually miss. Yeah, different character. It, it, uh, I found out, yeah, the Dawn is a character you only get if you pick the Dawn Caller. If you, if you use the Dawn Caller. Uh, which next run, I'm definitely not going to use some Dawn Caller just so I can get to see the other character. Your father achieves his ambitions. He'll become too powerful to stop. An undead lich can amass more and more power over centuries until, until he becomes invincible. Heard the stories of Lich Queen Morganis. I'd rather not relive the old legends in my time. I should tell my father I hoped he would enjoy a long and healthy reign. It did not mean that he should rule over our, or rule our country for all eternity. Suddenly this all makes sense. You'll never become king. Not as long as your father rules and he'll rule forever. Unless I have something to say about it. You mean to murder your own blood? If something is already dead, killing it is not murder. At least that is what I told my old friend Lorenko. Then I ran a stake through his cold and dead heart. Screw you, Lorenko, you fornicated with my wife! Just kidding, that was a lie, I was never married. <laughs> okay. I thought Buggy was a weird tone killer. <laughs> this guy takes the fucking cake. A lich is no longer my father. For all intents, he died long ago. 
And have no, I held no qualms about putting him in the grave. Neither should you. There's no skin off mine, I've already killed a grandmother. Old people become monster, evil monsters surprisingly often these days. Help me depose my father and you'll have a powerful ally. You already have the Vikings and the dragons on your side. Still, even with their might, you have little chance of victory. However, if the new Stixian king were to support you as well, you could crush Mortimer. Come with me to the capital of Kaedom. Meet my father and see for yourself. You want us to meet your father after we just killed his men? I already have spies who will inform him that bandits, the bandits did it. This will not be the first slave caravan, caravan to disappear. Come with me and pose as my foreign mercenaries. Where, what are we going to do? Storm the throne room? Not exactly my father. He keeps a tight leash on my movements. Obtaining permission to leave the country did not come easily. I have to report back to him on the regular or he grows angry. What does that have to do with me? I want you to pose as a mercenary, a mercenary I have hired for protection. I've been feeding him lies about attacks on our border patrols. So you'll act as a bodyguard who protects me while I'm traveling. Hmm, well, I'm good at acting like the strong silent type. I used to work as a mercenary before bod bodyman hired me. Will Kang X expect anything? Hopefully, hopefully not. I have no. I have to report back soon, though. If I delay, it will make him paranoid again. See, let me discuss this with Halga and Tindaris. So I'll give us some time alone. Very well, but don't delay. I have to return by the morning. You better not spill the beans or I'll unleash my full power. This skeleton is bone armed and fully operational. Guy's fucking nuts. Oh, good, Tindars. You heard him. What do you think about this? The Prince of Styxia is ambitious and his goals are obvious. He wishes to become a king, something he will never accomplish on his own. Imagine living as a slave to your undying father's whims. He needs us for his plan to succeed. His interests thus align with ours. Trust will only be a relationship so far. I'd prefer to rely on benefits. Grandmother said the same thing to me. You take after her. Mm. I said we go along with Darius. I said we go along with Darius' schemes. I always prefer a human king's rule. We don't have the Lightbringers to fight off the second Lich Queen Morganis. Well, I mean, technically we do. Best to kill Kangax now before he has a, before he has a mass country-destroying strength. Agreed. Darius has proven himself to us. He waved plenty to gain. Hornheim and Teamide will not have the power to take down Mortimer. Third ally in Stixia would allow us to cinch the victory. Clinch the victory. Instead, we'll go along with Darius' plan. Thank you for your thoughts, Helga. Tindaris. Appreciate it. Mm. Mm. A moment of your time, love. I want to speak with you. Speak up. I am sorry. I am responsible for taking care of the girls you saw among the slavers. I notice your men did not strike down any of my dancers. I am grateful to you. We do not come here to kill innocent women. We are here to rescue our enslaved people. King Kangax ordered my girls to accompany Sethos and his slavers for entertainment. We danced for them, we kept them company, and we endured their wretched behavior. I took no pleasure in it, I assure you. I believe you, however, we cannot let you return to the capital. We risk the king learning the truth. The girls have no desire to return to Styxia. With the slavers gone, they are finally free. King Kangax will assume they were abducted or killed, so I doubt he will search for them. They've decided to seek ref refuge elsewhere, traveling the world as performers. That is fair, the world would do, go would do good to see a more artistic side of Styxia. However, I have a question to ask. Do you currently have a dancer or a bard in your service? We do, his name is Angelus. Then I shall not insult him by offering to join you. No! I want to do them! Fuck. I guess if you sent away Angelus, you get her. Damn, though, she's a definitely a better dancer, though. With those skills. I much prefer looking at you than him, to be honest. Dang, yeah. Appreciate the compliment, handsome. However, I will take my leave now. Thank you, Zari. Thank you. Take care. Oh, we got a boots. We got boots anyway. Fuck yeah. More for Angelus. I'll probably give it to someone else. Helga can really use those. There's nine movements zipping around. Greetings. Wait, you don't look like a Stixie enslaver. Perceptive, aren't we? You have the bearings of an Andoran noble. What are you doing here? I'm Varg of House Darkhold. Varg? Angelus' older brother? You know Angelus, I see. You must be Jaka, Bodyman's ally. 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 Why did I say that? Ally. My little brother told me many stories about his rebel crew. How is the young prince doing? Is the King Thorgrim still sick? Wait, you don't know about what happened in Andoran? I'm busy scouring Styxia's news. No time to the Styxia's desert. No time to catch, up, to catch up on the news. I can't fucking speak. What has happened? I explained, but we're in the middle of something right now. It stands. Any friend of Angelus is a friend of mine as well. If you don't mind, maybe I can tag along. It's not like my search is bearing fruit. Your search? I'm trying to find a place called the Tomb of Horrors. It's an ancient ruin, long lost to the average Styxian. Oh, well, uh, I happen to be traveling with a fellow who might know the location. He's quite knowledgeable about Styxia. I'll have to trouble you then. I'm at my wit's end with the search. 
Stick around and I'll see if I can introduce you to him later, Varg. And he thanks. Ah, there you go. I knew it. Oh, hello there. What do you want, little girl? Where are your parents? Petalfield is no place for a child to wander about. Mother is back in my village. My father left when I was little. So you're in this vast desert all by yourself. You're too adorable to be a brigand. Searching for my father. My mother says he's a great sage. I see. Best of luck with that. Hey, you look like a sage and you have hair like mine. I think we're related because we, have, we share a similar hair color. What sort of logic is that? Did you spend time in a fishing village in northern Andaran? Oh my gosh, you did, didn't you? I can see it in your eyes. I've traveled the world for years. I've visited numerous villages. My name is Runa. My mother's name is Marianne. Do you remember her? You do remember. You're my daddy. I finally found you. I see you wield a, wield a bow. Are you untalented with magic? I was the best hunter in my village. It felt natural to fight with a bow. I always want to learn magic. Then I can be a cool sage like you. Hmm, I see. Why do you ask? Oh wait, are you going to teach me? Oh well, perhaps my experiment did spare some fruit after all. Your experiment? Travel the land with the purpose of siring offspring with commoners. I want to see if mixing my blood with theirs would affect magical talent. Family believes that only noble blood will sire a powerful off offspring. I was planning to return each child that, or to, re to return to each child after some time to evaluate them. So that's why you left. Mother refused to tell me. Uh, I never expected that one of my twenty-nine test subjects would actually seek me out. Excuse me. Okay, whoa, 29, okay, goddamn. Quite fascinating, really. Suppose it'll save me the time of traveling there. Look forward to evalu evaluating the results. Runa, was it? Let's talk later. I don't feel so good. Yeah, that's, uh, that's a bit fucked there, yeah. Meanwhile, back in Andoran, along the northern coast. Oh yeah, this map. Oh, Alvaro's killing people. Not oh, great. That's Cassandra there, that's for sure. And the rest of the people there. Cassandra, what is the meaning of this? What are you doing? Mortimer, so good to see you. Have I offended your grace? Don't play word games with me. Don't tell me why you're killing these people. This goes against my commands. Mother, even for you, this is going too far. You should not hear about the revolt. These peasants spoke against you. They said that you would be an even worse king than your father. So you're killing them all? Who gave you the right? What would you have us do? They committed treason. I will not summon an age of terror upon Andoran's people. I tend to bring about an era of peace and prosperity. Now, oh, now, little Morty. Let's not act all high and mighty. Not after you ship those poor prisoners off to Styxia. I think you are wise enough to see some cleansing must follow. We cannot allow people to speak ill of your reign, can we? You. Especially with enemies like Jaka rally rallying to the east. Are you going to make an enemy of Flameguard at this time? Do not attempt to worm your way out of this the people here may have qualms about my reign. Morty, look, there's still a survivor. Yeah, don't kill Runa's mom, please. Especially after what she just learned about her father. King Mortimer, you villain, you detestable bastard. Ten thousand curses upon Thorgrim's hellspawn. My friends, my neighbors, all dead because of you. No, I never meant for any of this to happen, miss. I'll do what I can to fix the damage Cassandra wrought. If you would just give me a chance, I will compensate. Ah, uh, you fucking... Ah, uh, you bitch. Cassandra! You're too soft, Mortimer, dearest. Don't argue with your lessers. Better to silence, silence them when they start acting too uppity. That is it. I've had enough of your insubordination, Cassandra. Do you wish to face execution? Mortimer, Mortimer, wait. Calm yourself. Please do not judge my mother so hard... My, my mother harshly. Surely she will see the error of her ways. Yes, of course. I should have asked you first, great king. That was my mistake. I am but a stupid woman, after all. You think clever words will save you? It seems as eminence does not find my jokes amusing. In the future, I shall defer to your judgment. This, I promise. Next time you disobey me, I'll put, I'll put your head on a spike. Brianna, with me. Yes, Morty. Wishing you luck, Cassandra. But be careful if I were you. Oh, Pish, what is, what is little Morty going to do? Kill his wife's mother, his cute little auntie? Mortimer has already slain both of his brothers. You think you aren't, you are any safer than they are? They were. You make a good point. But for a fact, Mortimer did not pretend to love Bodiman. By comparison, he would not shed even one tear over your demise. Yes, yes, no need to lay it on. You've said enough. 
good, now that not that I'd care if he ended your existence. It would be a net positive for Andron's stability. Don't you have something more important you should be doing? Like tracking the Jaka core? Worry not about my competence. I can keep I keep I keep an eye on Jaka's movements. He has recently traveled to Castle of Dragonhand to save King Tendaris. He intervened in that Manakeet's assassination, earning accolades. Now he resides now he resides within Dragon's Fire, buttering up Timite's King's further King Timite's King further. He still remains there, from what I've heard. <laughs> Something funny. My spice tummy Jock and Tendaris left Dragon Hand two nights ago. Seems your spies are not, are not as up to snuff as mine are. <laughs> so he left. Where is he gone now? I'm not certain, but I know that boy is up to no good. Jock is fueled entirely by revenge. Jock may only be a commoner, but his father was an excellent soldier. I've been reading up on his old records. We mustn't underestimate the wretch. Let's see which of us can prove more useful to the little king then. Hmm. First one to catch Jock wins. I was with the games, Cassandra. I can't take this. I can't stand that woman. Morty, I'm sorry. I, didn't, I don't know what- I don't know- I didn't know my mother did this. She killed all those innocent people. Those villagers. It's unforgivable, these nobles and their games. I hate all of them. No, you do, Morty. So- and so do I, but we must remain patient. The day of reckoning is drawing closer. Remember our plan. I- You're right. I'm sorry, Brianna. Didn't mean to lose my temper. I understand you better than anyone. You don't need to apologize to me. But I do. I hate all of this. Why? Why did Bard have to find a Lightbringer? He was never supposed to die. He was supposed to be my shield after I defeated Randall. I'm so lost to that his encouraging words. He treated me better than I deserved. Ultimately, I spat in his eye. You have to be strong. Nothing can be gained without sacrifice. Heavens, Bodyman was such a good man. And a kind brother. The, vi the Divines are truly cruel. Yes, the Divines for strength. Will they freely grant you strength? Or will they grant you the chance to become stronger? If you want to change the world, you have to act cruelly, Morty. Not to others, but yourself. You're the one who told me that. I was. The vines are testing you, Morty. Will you buckle under the pressure? No, my will shall become unbreakable. Thank you for your words, Brianna. If I didn't have you at my side, I don't think I would come as far as I have. I must be willing to sacrifice everything. Only then will we obtain a world free of evil. Only then... And now we're starting to slowly see his descent into being truly mad. I know for sure there's going to be scenes later. I have a feeling either we're just going to find fighting Brianna or he's going to figure out she's kind of slightly manipulating him because I can, I can tell. It's like, I mean, I could be wrong, but I feel like it's like she's going about it at a more subtle way than Cassandra is, which would be interesting if that did happen. I don't know. About to see. Anyway, now we have ourselves. <laughs> we we did that, you know, kind of. All, I mean, that all right desert chapter. I'm kind of sad I missed out on a pet rock and a hermern, but I mean, whatever. I have a decent amount of hermerns, and I can use another one on like the allspice and allpice or whatever you probably pronounce it. In any case, we're gonna be heading to chapter twenty four next. Hopefully, not another goddamn desert chapter, but it's not like it mattered too much. Uh, only, only Isabel gets affected by the movement from my from the army I'm using. In any case, that's gonna be for this episode. So I'll be seeing you guys next time. Take care.